I remember when I was nine years old, looking up at the sky dreaming. My grandfather would always tell me to not give up on my dreams and to see things differently. Late afternoons with my grandmother, she would tell me that without action, dreams are nothing. So I would spend hours out there just dreaming of what the future could look like. This was the 70s, so there were riots then, the anti-war protests, police issues, crime, and then my family just trying to survive. This was the street, this was the school, and this was the house. This place has never been just a district to me. It's always been home. I didn't pick up and move my family to a different neighborhood once my career started. My house is still in the same community that I grew up in. You see, roots matter to me, communities matter to me, and regardless of politics, you matter to me. Everything I've done has been about serving other people. At 17, I started my journey in leadership as president of the NAACP Youth Council. Then, when my city had a need, I answered the call and became a city commissioner. But it was when I saw the challenges on the state level that I knew I had to go to Tallahassee and do my part to bring change to the community that I love. For 13 years, I fought, worked, battled, and stood up for what's right. Passed legislation for people that have always been overlooked, just like I was. I leaned on my faith, my family, and put my grandmother's words to take action to heart. And now I'm running for United States Congress, and I'm gonna do the same thing that I've done my entire life. Serve my community, fight for those who've been overlooked, and continue to dream for what I know Florida can be. Let's dream and fight together.